The reason to get screened for colorectal cancer is because colorectal cancer is the third leading cause of cancer and deaths in the United States. 90% of it is preventable, so we look at colorectal screening as a uh, beneficial test to prevent cancer. The individuals who should be screened for colorectal cancer include everybody after or at age 50, and also if there are family members that have had colon cancer or colon polyps, the relatives of those people, including siblings or parents or their children, should be screened at an earlier age, about 10 years before the diagnosis of their colon cancer or their colon polyps were detected. And it's important to know that colon cancer is equal, unfortunately, in men and women in the United States, and so it is an equal opportunity disease, unfortunately. And again, it is preventable by 90%, and that African Americans and people of Jewish ancestry should be checked at about age 45, actually. Some of the symptoms of colorectal cancer can include no symptoms at all, actually, or it can also include weight loss, abdominal pain, rectal bleeding, change in bowel habits, or some diarrhea and constipation. The preparation for a colonoscopy has dramatically improved over the last several years. It involves a clear liquid diet the day before, and then after the procedure, the patient can go back to work the next day. There are many methods to determine and to visualize colon polyps or colon cancer. The first one is a flexible sigmoidoscopy. That is an older test. It unfortunately only looks at maybe a quarter or about half of the colon. So therefore, it is limited in its evaluation. The second one is a virtual or CT colonography. The problems and limitations of that test include radiation. There is no sedation given with that and the person still has to take a preparation. The other issue is if a polyp is determined or detected, it cannot be removed at that time, and the person needs to make another appointment for a colonoscopy to remove the polyps. And the third method to detect colon polyps and colon cancer is usually the gold standard, and that is a colonoscopy. At the time of the colonoscopy, the entire colon can be visualized safely and polyps can be removed at that time. If we can catch these polyps at an early time so that they do not grow into cancer and we catch them at a precancerous stage, that is really the benefit of doing the colonoscopy. The main way to reduce the risk of colorectal cancer is to have a screening colonoscopy performed. Lifestyle changes are also very important. Controlling or avoiding diabetes, avoiding smoking, Having a healthy diet with less red meat consumption are also very important. We understand that you're very anxious and apprehensive to have a colonoscopy performed. It's very important to have the colonoscopy performed for more peace of mind and prevention. We want to keep you in good health, not find problems, but we want to prevent problems. 